Okay, I recently had to install Windows XP from USB stick and I found out a really easy way to do it. All you need is a USB stick like this one. I put together this quick video post, hope you find it useful, enjoy! Okay, we're on the PC and we've got the USB stick connected, you can see it here. It's formatted to NTFS, but I don't think the format matters. We're going to open a browser and we're going to type win setup from USB. Navigate here. Scroll down, fight the ads a little bit, and this is the utility we're going to download. Okay, with that done, we're going to copy and then extract this on the desktop. Open up the folder and we're going to run this setup utility, win setup from USB x64. You can see it's detected the flash drive. To prepare the stick, you're going to need a few things. You're going to need a Windows XP ISO that is extracted into a folder, and also any drivers that you need for the Windows XP setup. These are going to be specific to your machine. So the first thing we do is go here, and you can see that it says select the Windows 2000 XP source where the i386 folder is located. So let's click that. Navigate to our Windows XP folder and hit select. Accept the Microsoft EULA and then go. Okay, that's done. We'll close down the app. And next, we will copy these drivers over to the new USB stick. This USB stick is now ready. So we'll eject and we'll move over to the PC ready to install WinXP. Okay, powering up the old retro PC, we've got the prepared USB stick connected and configured to boot from. The first screen you'll see when the USB stick boots is this OS select menu. You can see it's detected that we have Windows XP source materials ready to install from. So let's hit enter. And then next, the Windows XP install will happen in two halves. First, we have the text mode install, which basically prepares the hard disk and copies the files across. And second, we have the graphics mode install, where we configure Windows XP. So we do these in sequence. So first we select three, enter. Okay, we're in the Windows XP setup. From here, this is just like any other Windows XP setup. No special things to do. So I'll whiz through this really fast. Enter. Here's my target disk, enter again. Quick format to NTFS, why not? Press F. Okay, copying files.
Okay, so the text mode install is done. We've rebooted to the USB stick and we're back to the setup menu. This time we pick number four, the second part of the Windows XP install, the graphical mode setup. We'll click our way through these menus, all the defaults, nothing special here. With this last reboot, we can take the USB stick out and let Windows XP set up boot directly. These last few screens, we'll click next, next, and skip, finish. That's it, Windows XP, so easy. If you put the USB stick back in, you can see those drivers that we copied earlier. You can go in here to install any of the system drivers appropriate for your system. And we're done. So that wasn't too hard at all. Certainly the easiest way to install XP from USB stick, in my opinion. Hope you find this guide useful. Enjoy.